Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new episode of, you guessed it, Charlie Go. As you always know, I'm Charlie Go, and I want to start by saying thank you so much for all of your birthday wishes last week. It was such an amazing day and I am just so excited that I got to start and kick off my Astral Radiant series, our Astral Radiant series with you guys on my birthday. It was absolutely perfect and I had a blast digging into the first round of many to come uh, Astral Radiance openings. And so in that regard, we will be continuing our Astral Radiance episodes or series today. But before we get started, I wanna go ahead and do my spiel so we can get it out of the way and so that I can welcome all of you guys who are brand new to our channel to the amazing Charlie Go family and community. You guys are always so awesome and everyone is welcome, whether you're brand new to Pokemon or you've been a part of the Pokemon community your entire time, uh, or the entire time that Pokemon has been out, the entire 25 years. Whatever your knowledge base is of Pokemon, this is the place to be because we are here to support everybody. Uh, whether you have a channel or you just want to learn more or you're a collector or you actually play TCG uh, Pokemon, whatever it is, we hope that you join our awesome community and share your Pokemon knowledge with each other. Um, that is something that is really, really so fun about being part of a community like this is that not everyone knows everything and so this is an opportunity for us as well as myself to continue to learn and grow in this awesome awesome world of pokemon so if you're interested in joining this community make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button right now uh or at some point uh hit the like button and subscribe button so that you can become a part of this community also every single week prior to the newest episode we have at least one a clip from the upcoming episode that will be aired on social media. So we have Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. And as part of that clip, there will be one of the code cards that will be airing in the upcoming episode. So if you're following at least one of those accounts, then you have the opportunity to get early access to at least one code card prior to the newest episode. Uh, and it could be the morning of the new episode or the diet before or whenever that episode um, or whenever the clip is going to air. I don't know, it just kind of depends. And um, so you better keep an eye out for that. But the best way to do that is to follow either TikTok, um, Instagram, or Twitter, or all three, that's even better. And those will also be the places for you to get updates on the latest Charlie Go episodes when we finally do, do a live. I'm feeling a little bit more confident with my new setup. And so if you see anything that you're like, mm, maybe that should be changed a little bit, let me know. <laughs> Um, because I want to have you guys feel comfortable as well as me, so that's part of it. But just make sure you do that, and I'd love to see all of you join our awesome Charlie Good community. So now that that's over, I'll go ahead and tell you what we will be opening today. So we had a blast with Brilliant Stars, and one of the cool things that we started with Brilliant Stars that we hadn't done before was opening a build and battle stadium. And so I saw a building battle stadium on the Pokemon Center website for Astral Radiance and I just couldn't help myself. Of course, of course, I, I just had so much fun with it and it was so different from maybe opening a Elite Trainer box or a Booster box, all of it, it's very, very different. So if you haven't seen a building battle stadium or a building battle box at all, this will be an opportunity for you to see something a little bit new um, for you uh, for in, in the Pokemon world or in Pokemon openings. So here is a sneak peek of what we'll be opening today. It is the Build and Battle Stadium for Astral Radiance. And so I'm gonna show you a little bit of what's inside. Um, you can take a look at this and this beautiful box with all of our beautiful Dialga and Palkia on the outside, as well as, um, oh my goodness, I always forget that third one. I am so sorry. Oh, well, there we go. We see, oh wait, we see uh, one of our legendaries on the front. And then of course we have our Typhlosion explosion on one side. Absolutely beautiful. Um, this will just give you a enter the Pokemon, Pokemon Stadium ready for battle. It'll just tell you a little bit about I guess the theme behind this fantastic Build and Battle Stadium. And what's really, really cool about the Build and Battle Stadium is it gives you all the cards and materials that you need for two players to play TCG for Pokemon. So um, there'll be two boxes if you can see this image right here. So within this main box that you see, there'll be two boxes, each one containing uh, everything that 
one player needs each box goes to one player uh, for to actually battle it out in Pokemon TCG. So you'll see at the bottom, uh, two individual build and battle boxes will each contain 40 card ready to play decks. So you get the entire deck. Each deck includes one of four unique foil promo cards. So that's the real plus about getting it through or your deck through the Build and Battle Stadium is that you will also get one of four unique promo cards only available through the Build and Battle Stadiums. Um, but if you get one Build and Battle Stadium, you will only get two of those cards. So there's no guarantee that you'll get all four even if you bought two Build and Battle Stadiums. Anyways, uh, you get four additional Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Astral Radiance booster cards, so you get 12 in all. Uh, then you get 121 Pokemon TCG Energy cards, because we all need extra energy, six damage counter dice, one competition legal coin flip die, two acrylic condition markers, and a collector's box to hold everything. So this is what we'll be opening today. And I'm really excited to get to do this again because I feel like it's been forever. It's definitely been quite a few weeks since we've done a Build-A-Battle Stadium and I enjoyed it so much last time. Hopefully you guys did too. And if you haven't watched that one, make sure you go back and watch it because it was super fun. Okay, now that we are done introducing everything, getting through our spiels and introducing and welcoming all of you guys to a brand new episode, Without further ado, let's get opening. Okay, so we see that we have this beautiful box as much as we love this lovely shine that comes with the plastic wrap. I will just say I get so much satisfaction from taking off that plastic wrap because then we don't have as much of a reflection. So I'm having some issues, I will say, with my camera shaking. Um, so I'm gonna have to work on that, maybe set it up differently, but I'm not sure. So if you see the camera shaking, I promise I will work on that. Um, it's every time I move the desk, the camera just starts shaking. So that's probably not a good thing whenever you're trying to open Pokemon cards and that requires a little bit of movement. Okay, we got the plastic off, success. So now you can see this a little bit better. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful, beautiful front image. And you get to see the Astral Radiance Build Battle Stadium, obviously what we read on the back and just some Pokemon information. So now let's take a look at this beautiful box. Oh, fantastic, I love it. Take a look at that. So it's the same thing on the inside, but you do get a little bit of an extra decor on the, oh, there we go. Then we get our other legendary on the back and then that beautiful water Pokemon right there. So that is your collector's box to hold everything, which you can also use as a uh, protector uh, for all of your collections. So similar to the Elite Trainer boxes, you can use these to hold all of your cards in if you don't have any other form of protecting your cards or organizing them. So that's also a huge plus of getting one of these. Okay, so here we go. Let's take a look at inside. So we're got, we have a little bit of a similarity uh, with our Elite Trainer boxes, but we don't have the divider and it is a little bit different with regard to content. So we start with our damage counters, of course, that's important. Um, and then this is our big thing of energy. So just in case you didn't get enough energy today, didn't get your coffee in, your caffeine, whatever it is, here is all the energy you could possibly need right there. And of course, that's really because this is supposed to give you everything you could possibly need for a battle. So in order to actually battle with TCG, you have to have energy um, in order to have your Pokemon actually get out there and do what they're supposed to do. Okay, here are our die. There we go. We get all these beautiful dice right there. And of course, they said we get four extra, which I'm assuming that means that we get some, I can't remember. It's been over a month since I did a video uh, on building battle stadiums. I think you do get some in here. I think they said 12 in all. So it looks like you will probably get four in each of these and then four booster packs at the end uh, for this. So I'm actually going to, hmm, should I wait and do these? Oh, I love the fact that each one of these has a different uh, pack art to it, which is kind of cool. Um, I'm going to put these aside real quick and pull out our build in battle boxes. Okay, let's just go ahead and get these out and then I'm gonna put everything else back in. So it doesn't look like we get an extra code card or anything for you guys, but don't worry, you will be getting all the code cards. I will not forget. Um, so I'm gonna put this back on, the lid back on, my building battle stadium, and put that down to the side so we can see. Okay, so now you see we have both of our build and battle boxes. So what I'm gonna do is, I think I'm gonna do kind of a competition between the two. So we've got the 
for me, this is the left one and this is the right one. So that's what we're gonna go with, okay? And then we also have these last four booster packs. So that will be, you know what? I'm gonna save these for the end because that just makes it more exciting. Okay, I'll put these right here for you guys so I won't forget. Let's start with, hmm, I'm feeling the left one right now. Okay, so the right one's staying right here. And let's see, here we go. Kicking it off with our first build and battle box. So if you, yeah, like I said, if you haven't opened a build and battle box before, you're about to see all that you could possibly need in order to, I guess, get started with your battle, TCG battle. Okay, I don't wanna rip anything, but I also wanna open this. How do I do that? Oh, ha ha, it slides out, of course, because I just need help with figuring life out. Um, so this is really cool. It's got a nice little box that you can put everything in. Uh, probably not as sturdy as your Build and Battle Stadium, but you can see that it does actually have a little tab here that you can use to keep it closed were you to want to keep everything inside of here. So it does come up with four booster packs. Uh, you do get, oh, there we go. There is our first, ah, I'm just gonna knock everything over. Um, before we go, before we look at that, sorry. I'm going to go ahead and, there's way too much stuff up here, open this up to show you guys what's on here. So we see, ah, there we go. So this is the building tips. Get ready for the building, build and battle Pokemon TCG Astral Radiance expansion. Um, this also tells you about the origin form of Dialga, uh, origin form of Palkia. Then we've got Decidueye, Typhlosion, and Samurott, all of our primary Pokemon in this Astral Radiance series. What's really cool also is on the back, you have your list of all the Astral Radiance cards. So if you were planning on trying to complete the master set, you could actually use this uh, to check off the cards that you have, which is something that is also a huge or a fun thing to do in order to uh, complete your set. So here are all of our booster packs from this build and battle box. And then of course we have this fantastic little this, these are the 40 cards that they mentioned for your set that you have. And of course, I do have this little code card. And if you don't know anything about the online TCG gaming, um, you can actually play Pokemon without damaging any of your actual cards that you open uh, by playing online. And each one of your booster packs, or I guess special boxes, will come with at least one code card. And the really cool thing about that is you plug it in on your online TCG account and that will allow for you to open up virtual uh, Pokemon booster packs and, or get virtual special cards, depending on what the code card is for. And you can actually play and battle with people online, which is something I enjoy doing too. So if anyone ever wants to play, you know where to find me on social media and you can message me privately because I don't want everyone putting all of their information out there for everybody, but we can actually battle. That would be super fun. So I'm gonna save this one for the end, but you will see all the booster packs as we go along, but that one being part of this 40 card set, I, I just wanna save for the end. Okay, so we kind of got a glimpse of this, which is super, super fun. So remember at the beginning, we mentioned that there are one, there you will get one of four in every build and battle box. Uh, special cards, promo cards that are specific to the build and battle stadiums or build and battle boxes. So let's see what our first one is. We got a Magnezone Hollow. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful card. Oh my goodness. And I love the way that they made the Astral Radiance symbol at the bottom look. It is beautiful, a little off center, but nothing that would ever take away from the excitement of Magnezone. I actually haven't looked up the four cards, so I don't know what other ones that I could possibly get from this, but we do know we got one of four. We got Magnezone. Now, knowing my luck, the other one will have the same one, so we will only find out about one, but who knows? We might get more than that, but there is our first, first pool, guys. First pack magic. That's what I'm going to call this. Magnezone. Okay, so this also gives you, look at that. So you have energy, which usually tells you the type of energy in your build and battle box usually tells you the type of Pokemon that you're going to get. So not everyone's going to, this one will probably have different energy in Pokemon than this one. So you see primarily dark and steel energy, which means, so you get your trainer cards, see all that. Oh, see, look, there we go. We got some steel. So Registeel, Magnemite, Magneton, Magnazone looking awesome and mighty, and our Jubilife Village 
trainer card choice cynthia's ambition ultra ball dark patch and like i said we got our dark pokemon to go with our dark energy absol looking awesome and we have a little bit of mixture in there we have an oshawa but the interesting thing is is it has a normal sign right here which means even though it's a water pokemon you can use any type of energy in order to uh, use the powers that be that it has um so it doesn't matter that it's a water pokemon so those energies would work we have Dewat and of course the Hisuian Samurott, which is, it transforms into a dark Pokemon, which works perfectly with our dark energy. So those are your 40 cards that you would get in this particular box. That's not the same for everyone, but those are really, really cool. Okay, so let's open these real quick. Ah, the booster packs, here we go. So I see our Samurott on the front. We got a couple Samurotts with this one. Let's see what we get. I guess, well, okay, let's call it first pack magic. I know the other one wasn't a pack, but I like to think it was. Okay, and so our first official pack, and or, or here is your very first code card. Make sure you put those in on your online TCG accounts, you guys, because I would love to see you guys playing. And if you do use it on your online TCG accounts, tag me on TikTok if you make a video out of what you open or Instagram or whatever, because I'd love to see the actual packs that you get because they are usually different than the booster packs that you get the code cards from. So I'd love to see that, tag me in those. Okay, and our first energy is, we have some fire energy. We're kicking it off with some fire. Okay, we have Togetic. It's looking awesome, be sharp. Oh, Perugly, breaking things. Swinub, Petalil, Nicket, always stealing things. Bergmite, oh, I love whenever they stick trainers in there. I think that's so fun. Hippopotas, see another trainer. I love it, looking mischievous. Oh, and we have a reverse hollow Rapidash looking absolutely fabulous. I love the way that this card, the artwork on this card is made. It almost has a, not watercolor, but semi watercolor look. It might be even water watercolors, but I love the way that it looks. It just makes Rapidash look majestic and wonderful. Okay, ready? Three, two, and a regular Braviary. So no first pack magic, but we did get a beautiful reverse hollow Rapidash. Absolutely stunning. And I'll put Rapidash right over here to be joined by hopefully some more fantastic reverse hollows. Okay, so very similar to pretty much anything else you open apart from a booster box. Uh, there is no promise as to what you could pull. So you could end up getting all reverse hollows with no hollows or no special cards or anything like that. But we're here to enjoy Pokemon, not just to pull crazy cards. I love it. Uh, and so let's keep on rolling and going. And I already see a Barboach. I think that's how you say it. I apologize if I said it wrong. Here is your second code card. Make sure you're putting that in on your online TCG account. Okay, three to the back. And what is our second energy? We have some steel energy. So we're adding to our already accumulated steel energy pile over there. Zisu, Golduck. Ooh, I love that. The way the water splashes up. Oh, super effective glasses. You have not worn glasses that work apparently until they, you have the super effective glasses. Okay, well, there's our Bar Roche. Oh, Eevee, perfect. Starting it, starting it strong, okay. And Heracross, Mantine, Hisuian Quillfish, and we have a Reverse Holo Curlia, looking fantastic, almost like she's almost dancing, and I love it. And ready, three, two, and a regular Hisuian Overquill. So we have our Quillfish and our Overquill in one pack. It's not looking very good for the left side, uh, build-in battle box but that's okay because i get to see all of these beautiful cards this is only my second opening of astral radiance so it's still very new to me i still haven't taken the time because of internships and fun things like that to look up everything that is in the set so it's still fairly new to me and i'm enjoying uh, opening up all of these oh i love this mantine that is really really cool i love like the sunset look in the background it really adds to almost like an elegance of Mantine jumping out of the water, but we're not there yet. So here is your third code card. Like I said, make sure you're putting those in on your online TCG accounts. Okay, here is our energy. Oh, some water energy, just like Mantine jumping out of that water. Okay, we got Whizcash, Temple of Sinnoh, Ursa Ring looking terrifying. Oh, there's our Mantine. Hisuian Quillfish, always. Ah, the Hisuian Basculin. Oh, Poochiana! I don't think I've seen this one. 
Oh, that is so cute with the snow. There's Glammeow and a reverse holo Yawn Mega in three, two, and a regular Braviary. That's okay. Okay, so left side is not doing well today, but that's okay. Um, we only have one more to go. So do you think, what do y'all think? Last bag magic maybe? Uh, for this uh, left box? I don't know. Come on, come on Decidueye. You gotta give us something. It's okay though, I am enjoying it. Oh, there we go. We got our Magnemite finishing off with that evolution, evolutionary tree, I guess. Okay, there is your last code card for the left box. Three to the back, and let's see what that energy is. Ah, some psychic energy. Are we seeing into the future? Are we gonna get something awesome? I don't know. Oh, we got a Hippodon. Oh, can we see the little bitty baby in the background? Oh, the Energy Loto. Oh, Quilava. I haven't seen that one. It looks so happy. I'm just jumping through the field. Magnemite. Teddy Ursa in the dark, looking like very mischievous. Absolutely mischievous. The Sue and Sneasel. Ooh, Scyther. Very nice. Oh, Mischievous. And a reverse holo Mighty Anna. Oh my goodness, I love that. So cool. Ready, three, two, and a Reg Eye. So nothing. Oh my goodness. Although I do love the Reg Eyes. Um, nothing big from that one particular build in battle box, but that's okay because we have an entire uh, second one to open and we have four other booster packs. So that's okay. We're totally fine. Okay, and we get to find out what that other uh, promo is. So. There is that one right there. I will put you right here. And since we only had one hollow from that one, there's nothing else to put with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this sleeve back on here just to keep everything together. Okay, and so here we're moving into, sorry, I don't want these to fall over. Moving into our right side. Left side didn't really do much. So right side, you gotta, a lot of room for, I guess, a huge win. <laughs> Let's see if we can do it. What do y'all think? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Okay, so I know better this time to take the sleeve off first. And here is our second building battle stadium. We have, I'm a, not gonna look at it and put it down here. Okay, here are our four booster packs and I see a Oshawa, Dialga, Palkia, and Decidueye. So four different packs this time. And of course, once again, you see the, this is the introduction and list of all the Pokemon in the set, which is always super fun. Okay, and let's see what our, which one of the four we got out of this one. If I get the same one, I'm I'm gonna laugh really hard. I was trying to do it without cutting the cards. There we go. And don't forget you're going to be getting this code card as well at the end, so don't go anywhere. Got so much going on over here. I'm gonna move these right here. Okay, and what is, which one did we get? Which hollow? Hey, we got another Magnazone! Look at that! <laughs> How did I know? I don't know, I just guessed that. That's okay, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. It's a little better centered too than the other one. Um, so we're starting off literally on this same, in the same place with the last box. I don't, I don't know what to, how to feel about this, honestly. <laughs> so we got another Magnazone, perfect. Um, I'll put you right here away from the other one just so we know who, which one goes where. So that tells me this is probably going to be, oh no, this is different. Okay, so we've got the steel energy and we have water energy this time. So that will be changing up our Pokemon a little bit. So we've got the trainer, we have Registeel, which is a very similar, the Magna, Magnas, um, and which is similar to the other one because we have the steel. And then we get into our, oh, there we go, Keldeo. And someone told me last time that that is actually a, uh, a, 
a rare Pokemon or a legendary, which I didn't know. So that's super fun. Thank you guys for informing me and helping me out with some of these facts that I don't know, because I, I really do appreciate it. Uh, we have Basculin, and that turns into, ooh, Basculegion. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I don't think I've seen that one. Oh wait, yes I have. Oh, okay, it just looks different in this picture, but that looks so awesome. Oh my goodness, that is so cool. Okay, those are all of our, the 40 cards that you would get in this particular box. Awesome, and let's go ahead. You know what, this time I'm gonna mix it up. Does it, last time it wouldn't have mattered because they were all, they, none of them had a hollows in it, but this time, let's make it matter, guys. Okay, I didn't look. I don't even know what's coming first. Okay, we're starting with Decidueye. Let's see. And your code card is, I always forget because it's different on the other side. There you go. There is your first code card from the right box. Okay, three to the back. And what is our energy? We have some water energy, perfect for this box. Okay, we're starting off with Golduck. Oh, we got our super effective glasses bag again. Cricketune, Magnemite, Ralts looking awesome in the flowers. A Sue and Sneasel, oh, Mistrevis, and our Barboge, and our Reverse Hollow Hisuian Basculegion, and three, two, and a regular Hisuian Arcanine. Still awesome, I love that artwork. Uh, Arcanine looks super awesome. Uh, a little dark, but I really love it because it matches uh, Arcanine's personality and traits that are found in Legends of Arceus, which is super fun. Make sure I get those separated. Okay, we are one down. They're still even. So let's see what we can do with this one. Oh, we got our Growlithe. Perfect with the Arcanine. And your code card is, there you go. Make sure you're putting those in. Okay, three to the back. This will be our sixth pack in and we have not pulled a hollow yet. I don't know what we're doing wrong. <laughs> we have a steel energy. We're enjoying it too much, that's the problem. Oh, his two went over quill. Kamado, oh, the Noctowl. That's the first time I've seen that one. Uh, Growlithe, oh, the Voltorb. Oh, Rufflet, looking all ruffled and cute. Ooh, Ponita. Oh, that's so beautiful. I love that, the way the sun comes in behind it. And our Bronzor. Oh, and a reverse holo Togekiss. Look at that. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. And ready, three, two, hey! Got the Beedrill V all art. What? <laughs> no way. Or is it the full art? I apologize. I don't know. I'm just so excited. This is beautiful. I think I think it's all. I think so. Cause look at all the Beedrill. But I could be totally wrong. Please correct me. But I'm just so excited. It is absolutely beautiful. <gasps> Great centering. Oh, that was worth the wait. Oh, that was worth the wait. Sorry, left side, right side box, just one. Uh, we don't even have to wait till the end, but that's okay. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. Oh my goodness, I need to protect this thing. Oh, that is amazing. That is absolutely beautiful, I love it. Oh my goodness, that was awesome, okay. Whew. I'm just gonna breathe a little bit. There we go. And let's get this one into a protector. The toga kiss, of course. Gotta get that kiss. Awesome, okay, two more. And then we have four more booster packs, but those are not part of our competition, so. But I'm pretty sure we already have a winner. Um, actually, I am 100% sure, and I just dropped the sleeve of the box, that's okay. Ooh, Ponyard. Whoa, is it like doing the splits or something? Quite sure, I guess we'll find out. Okay, code card is, there you go. And let's see what we've got, three to the back. What is our energy? Ready, three, two, and some psychic energy. That didn't work well for us last time. I don't know, I don't know what to expect. The unidentified fossil. Ooh, Bronzong, that's got a very like, I don't even, 
trippy vibe to it. Uh, we've seen some trippiness a little bit with regard to like slow, slow king, slow bro. They did a whole bunch of those like that. And so I guess they're messing with Bronzong too. It's kind of cool. Okay, Roxanne. Oh, potty art. Okay, it looks like he is doing the splits in the air. He is doing a toe touch, but without touching his toes. I love it. Yee-hee. Hair across. Teddy Ursa. Ah, there's that Mantine. Oh, and our reverse solo Rapidash. Fantastic. Ready, three, two. And, ooh, a Regalecki. Very nice. Okay, it's not a hollow, but I'll take it. That looks awesome. Oh, that is such a cool card. You know, I will say, we had a Red Dice um, as our last one in the, in the left box. So I'm not complaining about these regulars because look at that. That is so cool. I love it. It gives us, gives us an opportunity to see all these fantastic cards. Okay, the last one from the right side box. Let's see what this one has for us. And I already see a Rowlet. I love Rowlet. I feel like I say that about every Pokemon. That's okay. And your code card. Here we go. Three to the back. We have last pack magic from this box. Don't forget, we only have, we have four more and you have two code cards, so don't go anywhere. And some fire energy. Let's light a fire under this one. Okay. Oh, we're starting off with the unidentified fossil again. Oh, we got Dartrix, Drifblim, and we've got Rallet, of course, to go with Dartrix. Oshawott. Oh, Hoot Hoot. Cricketa. Uh, Stantler. Whoa! Oh my goodness! It's a, oh my goodness! It's our first trainer gallery card from Astro Radiance. Yes! Finally! And it's the Kingdra! Oh my goodness, that's amazing! And let's see what the last card is. And three, two, and a hollow Lilligant! And look at this beautiful centering on this Kingdra! And the Lilligant! Oh my goodness! Double for the win! For the win! Oh my goodness! This is awesome. That Kingdra and the Lilligant. I can't. I can't right now. That's so exciting. I was starting to wonder if they even put the trainer gallery cards in any of these packs. <laughs> okay, sorry guys. I don't even have to really compete or like the left side doesn't even have anything competition wise for this competition. Uh, I hate to hate to burst this bubble, but uh, <laughs> pretty positive that we know who the winner is. Okay, and our Lilligant. Here we go. I wanted to make it more of a competition, but I guess not. Goodness gracious, the winner is the right box. <laughs> okay, that was easy. Um, there we go. And let's get that sleeve back real quick. Okay. And so I can put this, hold on. Remember we have one more packs to go, so don't go anywhere. All that energy. I don't even know. Oh, right there. Got it. Okay. And there is the sleeve for our box. And let's finish off with these last four packs. And I'm gonna mix them up again just because that seems to work for us with the last box. Not that I think it makes much of a difference at this point because whatever's there is there. But it just might make a difference in what order if we pull anything that we pull it. Okay, we got Typhlosion Explosion. Let's see if Typhlosion brings us anything. Come on, mister. Okay, we got a Growlithe, I see. Oh, so cute. This is a little floof. I love it. Okay. And your code card. There you go. Then we gotta go three to the back. And what is our energy? Ooh, some fighting energy. I don't think we've gotten that this time. Ooh, Oxy! Overquill, Jubilee Village, oh, Growlithe, Voltorb, Rufflet, oh, there's that awesome Ponita card, Rowlet, and a Kasuan Decidueye Reverse Hollow. Definitely don't have that one. Super, super awesome, looking fantastic. I love the fact that Decidueye gets this little hat looking thing that comes up on its head. It looks so cool. Ready, three, two, and on a Leafeon. I'm not gonna complain about a Leafeon. Oh, I love, even though it's off-centered, I love my Leafeon. So we got this awesome reverse hollow Decidueye. You know what, I'm just gonna go ahead. I was separating these piles because I was gonna do the competition, but since there really is none, um, I'm just gonna put them all together. Okay, there we go. And our third to last, what are we gonna have third to last pack magic? Anybody, what do you think? 
What do you think? I don't know. Here we go. Oh, and I see a bronzer. And what is your code card? There you go. We're gonna go three to the back. And what is that energy for you guys? Some grass energy. So we're gonna give Leafy on some energy today. Noctowl Zisu or Zisu, Zisu. Uh, Dartrix, Bronzer, Oshawott, Hoot Hoot, Krikata, Stantler, oh, and our Reverse Holo Drifloon looking a little sad, almost like it's holding onto the, the branch and it's like, don't leave me. That's kind of sad. <laughs> Hopefully it's just admiring the branch. That's what I'm going to say. Okay, ready? Three, two, hey! Oh my goodness! Yes! He's doing the spooky live V! Oh my goodness! Yes! Oh, that's awesome! A little off-center, but really fantastic artwork there. It's almost like they took the regular and just exploded Decidueye onto this beautiful card because he just truly looks like he's coming out of the card. I love this. That is awesome. We needed a V. We got a V. I love it. That is fantastic. Okay. Was not expecting it. I'm excited. That's awesome. Two more to go. That's third to last pack magic. Let's see if we can keep this going. Hold on. There we go. And let's put this beautiful drift loon. Hopefully it's not sad. Hopefully it's just loving the tree over to the side. And two more to go. Second to last pack magic. What do y'all think? Oh, Decidueye. Come on, bring us some more luck. I'm loving this. Decidueye magic today. Ah, got a little pile of trash going on over there. <laughs> oh, Psyduck! We haven't seen you today. We've seen Golduck. Okay, here is your code card. Second to last pack. Let's see. Three to the back. Let's see what we've got for our energy. And some fire energy. Okay, let's light a fire under this. We have Togetic, Spicy Seasoned Curry, Curlia. Oh, there's our Psyduck. Oh, Togepi! Magnemite, Ralts, Hisu and Sneasel, and a Reverse Hollow Rufflet, and three, two, and a Mammoth Swine, looking super, super mighty, um, breaking ice, doing whatever Mammoth Swine does. I love it. And I have one more pack to go. My camera's about to run out of battery, and I'm a little worried that it will during this pack, but I'm gonna try to make it through. Oh, let's see if we can do this. Last pack, come on, last pack magic, anybody. What do you think? I might have to take the battery out after this one um, and put a new battery in just for the last few minutes of this episode because apparently this camera doesn't want to make it. Okay, here is your code card. Don't forget, you've still got two more to go though. Two more code cards, so don't go anywhere. Three to the back and let's see what that energy is. Last energy, oh, some electric energy, okay. Okay. Oh, wait and see Turbo. When we see it, there's our electric energy right there. We have Shield On, Silene, Mistrevis, Barboach. Oh, Pontiar doing his toe touch. Oh, easy. Perfect for the last pack. Heracross. We got our spicy seasoned curry. It's making me hungry. And ready? Three, two. And a regular cleaver looking awesome. Let's put our spicy seasoned curry into a protector. Okay, I'm going to have to pause this uh, really quickly before we do our roundup of all of our amazing cards that we pulled. So hold on, don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, so no last pack magic for us, but I think this entire thing has been absolute magic. So before we give you your last few code cards, let's go through all these amazing cards we've pulled today. Um, what's interesting about Astral Radiance is it does seem like it is a little bit more difficult to pull things, but at the same time, it's not that bad. It's not like battle styles or um, some of the more difficult ones, um, and so I'm really chilling rain, all of those fan all those fun ones, which were just difficult to pull, but it made the pulls that much more special. So this one's not that quite to that extent, but I think it's a good middle ground for us. Um, and so I've actually really enjoyed it. It's You don't expect a card with every pull, but you also, whenever you do get one, it doesn't feel like it's been ages since you actually pulled something. So let's go through everything we got. We have our a uh, beautiful reverse hollow, spicy seasoned curry, rufflet, drifloon, decidueye, mightyena, yanmega, curlia, rapidash and rapidash, togekiss, and our bascule legion, because we need a legion of bascula, bascus, <laughs> bascufish, 
That's what we need. And our amazing, amazing pools. We have the Husu and Lilligant dancing through the flowers. Our two Magnazones, a Decidui V, our amazing Kingdra trainer's gallery card, and of course, our Beedrill V. Oh my goodness, look at that. Absolutely amazing, so exciting. And of course, I'm not gonna forget your final two code cards. There is one, and there is the other. Make sure you're putting those in on your online TCG accounts. Oh my goodness, that was fun. I always enjoy building battle uh, stadiums. I say always, this is only my second one, but it's been so much fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it too. I know that we are just getting started with this amazing Astral Radiance series and we have a lot more to go uh, before the new one comes out, which is the Pokemon Go one. And I feel like I, haven't, I don't even have time to finish Astral Radiance first. But that's okay, because we're going to hopefully be able to mix and match some of that and, and, and get that started as well whenever it uh, actually gets released. So uh, hopefully I won't be too far behind and you guys can enjoy this with me. And I just thank you guys again for joining me for another episode. It has been an absolute pleasure to have you here, whether you're brand new, you're part of our community, or you're just wondering whether or not you want to be part of this community. Hopefully you make uh, the choice to stay and get to join us for more episodes and more opportunities to talk with each other, get to know each other, and get to know our amazing world of Pokemon. So if you are thinking about joining or if you are already joined, you've already hit that subscribe button and the like button, and you're looking for the Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter, make sure that you do that because remember we will have a brand new episode every single week. That brand new episode will always, there's always going to be one at least on Wednesday, every Wednesday at noon central standard time or one of these other times, whichever one matches your time zone, that is the time when a brand new episode of Charlie Go will always air no matter what. But also at the same time, if you're following our social media accounts, TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter, or each one of them or all three, then you'll also know if there's a random extra episode that we throw in just as, as a surprise. We finally do our live episode. I know I've been talking about that for months, but I really am working on it and it will be coming. And when it does, we're just going to have a blast together, uh, totally failing on this live streaming thing, but we'll do it together. And so it'll be super fun. I'm almost done with my in-person internship. So after that, I'll have a whole lot more time for the rest of the summer for my virtual internship um, to be able to get to put one together or try to find that time so that I can do that with you guys, hopefully like on a Friday evening, whenever maybe some of you guys are a little bit less busy, because I know even though it's summer, you have a lot to do and I'd love to get to have you guys join me, but you'll only know about that if you're following on social media, so make sure you do that. And thank you guys again for joining me for this episode. I just want to thank you for your continued support and love and especially for all those awesome birthday wishes from last week. You guys are awesome and I'm so glad you joined, but I hope to see you next time on Charlie Go. Bye guys.